Hey guys, and welcome to my Ratchet and Clank 2 playthrough. Um, I have made many, many save games, but they've not recorded properly, so I'm gonna make a new one. Woohoo! Right. When I. Welcome back to Behind the Hill. Tonight's heroes are the duo who recently restored peace and order to our galaxy Ratchet and Clank. So, gentlemen, tell us about your latest incredible adventures. Well, as you can imagine, we've been pretty busy. After Drek's defeat, there were parades, press conferences, fancy dress balls. And the wiener roast at Al's. Oh, yeah, that. And then things started to slow down a bit. After that, we, well... There was the grand opening at Groovy Lou. Right. I think that was last week. Six months ago. We're still pretty busy, but in a more, uh, domestic sense. Yesterday, I flushed out my radiator core. I guess no one needs a hero right now. <clears throat> or do they? Miss Bluebottom, I found our man! Welcome! What the... I'm Abercrombie Fizzwidget, founder of the Megacorp Company and the Bogon Galaxy. Bogon? I'm sorry to incapacitate you, but our entire galaxy is in a very precocious situation. I must humbly request your sustenance on a mission of dire urgitude, a mission of superfluous peril, a mission of unequivocal imperitude. Did that make any sense? So, you need me to go on a dangerous mission in another galaxy. Indubitably! A few days ago, this top secret biological experiment was stolen from our testing laboratory by this duplicitous criminal mastermind. And I need you to get the experiment back. We'll do it. We will. Frank, I am precipitating your recalcitrance and have made special improvisations for you. We are prepared to give you a job as the head accountant for Megacorp. Plus a penthouse suite and lovely megapolis. And our state of the art robotic masseuse. Deal. As for you, Ratchet, I'll need you on some purgatory shape. While in transit to the Pokemon Galaxy, you will undergo heavy training and conditioning, including martial arts, heavy weaponry, survival skills, stealth, lacrimate, ballroom dance, and origami. We've used bipolar vector regurgitation to track the thief's location to a flying base in Sector 7. It will tribulate the base and the tree the experiment. Sir, ready for launch. Last rush and client for you, they like the big words, even though it's a three plus game. So if you are young, I don't blame you if you don't understand. I'm not gonna speak too much now because there's a cinematic. There's people who want to see every cinematic, so here we go, it's just gonna come up. So Ratchet something. reporting. I'm on final approach to coordinates three seven alpha. Good luck. I'm counting on you. Affirmative. Beginning radio silence. Right, this is actually inclined to start in the mission. I'm gonna try and get this done as fast as I can. I did this mission in five minutes. Uh, exactly. Five minutes and one second. Right, we've got the Lancer and the Gravity Bomb. So we shouldn't have much trouble. The Lancer is basically your blast weapon. Uh, one. Here we go. First enemies, these spider like robots. Pretty easy to do. Especially when you've got the Lancer, which you get at the start of the game, so. Pretty simple. You've got your simple Omni Wrench uh, 3000. Don't know if I'm loud enough. Uh, you've got uh, your Omni Wrench 3000, which is the wrench, obviously. That's square, just to hit it like that. That's your Hyper Strike. Which is just that, it's X and square. And your comet strike is this, which is R1 and square. As you've noticed, there is a bar at the top, which is that is your mana tech, which don't know what that is. Your health, basically. Um, but you can get mana tech upgrades, which 
as you can see when I kill someone, right below that bar is another bar that moves along. It's orange, as you can see there. It moves along slowly as you gain XP. And then uh, once you get all crap, it didn't do well. Uh, these things do blow up and hit you. They introduced the two, uh, three enemies of those things and spider. Oh, I'm just going to call them spider robots. And weird and wondrous nicknames for these. And the flamethrower spider robots. Just, you just Try grab the bomb, the it's basically a mini nuke, but heads. it's pretty awesome. That was quite a bad shot. You're supposed to basically take care of every one of them. Right, here's a small cinematic. I see it's time to update my security forces. Whoa, 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 no, hey, no, no, look, I'm just here to fix the transflexor <coughs> coil. Nice try. Give my regards to Megacorp. Film. Crap. I was supposed to have the lancer there. Sorry about that. This is more of a dumb I am. I hate playing with cinematics like that. Collect every bolt because we will need that for buying new weapons. They are very good, just so you know. You've acquired nanotech. Not compared to Ratchet. Your health has improved. As you can saw, Ratchet haired. Here by holding L1. But I can help. I do know. Really it's fine. That's the only bad thing about this gun is that it runs out of ammo extremely fast. No! Right, I nearly got an anime boost, which you can see on the top. I'm gonna skip that part of that. I'm just gonna swap my film Ranger over in, sir. once I land because I'm using the air cap. There was a slight you don't problem. Really this. The thief escaped with the experiment, and I have no idea where he was headed. Not to worry. I just received an emission which may lubricate the matter. 
Do you have any maps for this quadrant of the galaxy? You bet, mister! We got galactic maps, 3D maps, foldouts, cutouts, maps to the stars, and their homes! Sorry about that. Oh, I forgot my wallet. Could you, you know, take care of this? Perimeter defenses deactivated. <laughs> You forgot your change. You forgot your change. Well, anyway, I, as I said, I'm I used the AM cap demo, so it only lasts about 12 minutes, and I'm going to 11 minutes. I don't want to risk it because I still taking about 30 seconds to set up with the AM cap to get the right size and reach. So I will be literally two seconds. For a map, press here. select for. Right, I'm back. Uh, I had to start it there because I had it up, but then I forgot to put the volume, the recorded volume, so I had a leave problem. Right, there's two simple missions on this. I'm gonna, now this is a very simple mission. I'm gonna do that in my spare time. Just go up here. Oh, sorry. Go up here. Go along here. And there's lots of what I call transporter dinosaur things. Dragons. No, oh, I don't wanna do that. Um, which basically you jump on and you take you some place. I'm just gonna get some ammo for my I don't quite have enough. I recommend you get that ASAP blitz gun, it's absolutely tank. Right, we go down this way and I'm probably gonna do about I'm not sure, I did twenty minute episodes and I put it on YouTube and it said that it was too long, so I'm not sure. A uh, quick word out to my friend, internet friend, uh, Onage360360, he kind of, I don't know if you can call it inspired, but he kind of brought me back to Ratchet and Clank, he used to play it when I was really young, and just really bought all the games again, and the classics I mean, like 1, 2, 3 in Gladiator, or in America, 1, Lock and Loaded, up your arsenal and devil. Just a warning, you cannot save any of the guys on this planet. It looks like you could, but you can't. And these are these things, those are crabbies, I call them. And those other slugger things, I just call them slugs. Because they look like slugs, these things. Your maximum mana attack has increased. See, he died and I killed everyone, so it's impossible. Oh wait, he... No, it's not... Um, it's not a swamp food area. I don't know if he'd spit out here. It's not going to be too good. And I've got a bad feeling that you cannot hear me very well. So... Turn up your volume. Turn up your volume, people. Because my mic is absolutely terrible. I'm getting a new one. And I'm going to put it here so you can hear me a little better. I'm going to speak up a bit. Hopefully that will help a lot. I just want to check something. How long has it actually taken me to do this so far? Six minutes to do the first mission. Not good enough. I did uh, four minutes, no, five minutes and one second, so not the la last one. But I wasn't talking, that's probably bad. Actually, am I going the right way? Yeah. Going here. You get a few chances to get out of the swamp areas. Press triangle to interrupt message. They asked me to, so I did. Flying light here.
as you probably realize starting playing Ratchet and Clank, um, two, sorry, you can rank up your weapons, I see something else here, which it should be, um, uh, first boss, sorry. That's a slight belt, I need to get my guy to come. It's easier to use your answer. Um, the first bosses are usually easy, and I was stupid enough to let it hit me because I w wasn't jumping about. But anyway, um, totally missed them parts. Kind of blend in. This is the Megacorp uh, factory. I'm running low on time. But this is the Megacorp factory. Um, which is basically Gadgetron from, well, it's, it's a different country, uh, company. Gadgetron went out of business if you just played uh, Mission Clank 1, so Mega Corp came along and they're basically the new Gadgetron. Right, for Gadget. It's not from Gadgetron. Right, Dynamo, it does simple tasks like that. It's pretty Press useless. So <laughs> that. Probably missed some crazy, but I need to. I want to get this done. I was so close. I had 20 minutes. And I didn't know. I really don't care about them right now. And there's a skill point uh, that you destroy all them. I'm not going to be doing the skill points uh, through only accidental skill points, but I will do an episode at the end of it all with all the skill points and platinum bolt or gold bolt. No, not gold bolt. Platinum. It's platinum, isn't it? I don't know. It's either platinum or titanium. I think it's platinum. But this is the part I was at 20 minutes, so I should be good. As long as I don't jump into the uh, swamp this time. Just like that really does not look obvious at all. This bit here, I was just sprinting to try and get it done. And I didn't have to make it Basic platform and skills. Should be able to do that easy. Yeah, I'm just going to come back for all these boxes in a later time. Um, I'm confused. It's up here. No. Yeah, it's definitely there. Sorry. Oh crap, I'm gonna run the team on that. Oh crap. No! Megacorps, please pronounce a 3% employee discount on all Megacorp merchandise. Tax laws still apply. What? Right, I'm just going to pause this video so I get just made it and also the cameras. Patrick, come in. Are you there? Copy, Mr. Fizzwidget. Listen, I have some new inflammation on our experiments wherewithal. The thief was indemnified at Megacorp's Maktar Resort. Also, the thugs have towed a moon-sized jamming array into Maktar Resort orbit. 
Should I take it out? A permulus. It's discomfrepulating our annual Galactic Gladiators broadcast. See for yourself. Ask yourself, are you man enough, hero enough, insane enough to step into the ring with two of the fiercest warriors in the galaxy? If you answered yes, you're a big, fat liar. But that's okay, because Megacorp is bringing Galactic Gladiators into your home for a special Mega View event. First, it's survival of the fittest in our bio competition. Be there as Chainblade, Chainblade, unleashes his fury on our Gladiator guest contestants. Chainblade has gone undefeated in 500 straight matches. But if the bio division doesn't do it for you, our robotics division will. Taste the adrenaline as contestants face off against our four-armed bandit, the B2 Brawler, Brawler, Brawler. No living creature is a match for this machine. Watch six tons of carbonox alloy hunt for its prey. There's no consolation prize, because this bad boy's programmed to show no mercy. So, what are you waiting for? Call now to bring Chainblade and the B2 Brawler into your living room. But put away the fine china. <laughs> the Galactic Gladiators, only on Mega View. Call your provider now. That's next episode, we'll do that. Chainblade, huh? I've got the coordinates. Ratchet out. And please like and subscribe. Um, I'm just going to end the episode here. Thanks for watching. You've been a great audience. Thank you.